Oh, Ohio State fans. After a six-point loss to Michigan late last month, Ohio State football was plunged into a period of uncertainty and despair. But this week, some players gave fans reason to be excited about the upcoming Cotton Bowl matchup, which will take place on December 29th, and perhaps even beyond that. Who is confident that Ohio State can secure another win? Leave your opinion here in the comments. And of course, if you're just arriving on our channel, don't forget to subscribe and like the video. I want to ask you, Ohio State fans, a question. How long have you been a loyal fan of this beloved team? 15 years ago? Leave it here in the comments. Now let's see what some players on our team said. Juniors Jack Sawyer, Tylik Williams, Emika Egbuka, Donovan Jackson, Denzel Burke and Jordan Hancock revealed to reporters on Tuesday that they will play in the Cotton Bowl against Missouri. This is great news for fans, as these players are talented and ready to show their drive and determination. Jack Sawyer, a Central Ohio native who was named to the All Big Ten second team, shared that many players are close to making important decisions about their futures. In the coming weeks, we will see many announcements of these decisions. Sawyer, Egbuka and Jackson arrived at Ohio State as five-star recruits, while Berkey, Williams and Hancock were also highly regarded as four-star prospects. Looking ahead to next year, Ohio State could lose anywhere from four to as many as 17 starting players. This is due, in part, to the NCAA's decision to grant an extra year of eligibility to players who played during the COVID-19 pandemic in 2020. Additionally, some players have already entered the transfer portal, while others may return if they choose for the extra year available. The biggest uncertainty is how many third-year players will decide to return. In addition to the six players who announced their participation in the Cotton Bowl, names like Marvin Harrison Jr., Trevayan Henderson, Mike Hall Jr., and J.T. Twimelau are viewed as likely recruits if they opt to leave school with one year of eligibility remaining. Marvin Harrison Jr., who won the Boletnikoff Award as the nation's leading receiver and was a Heisman Trophy finalist, has not yet decided whether he will play in the Cotton Bowl or return to Ohio State next season. He acknowledged that the desire to beat Michigan and win the Big Ten title could influence his decision. Regardless of what happens, Jack Sawyer stresses the importance of coming away with a victory over the Tigers in the Cotton Bowl. They want to end the season on a positive note honoring their teammates and showing their best performance. That's the latest news on the future of Ohio State football. Stay tuned for more updates and don't forget to like, subscribe to the channel and share with other fans. We will support our team until the end. Thanks for watching.